Robots Radio presents The Omega Broadcast, a Fallout story. Let's see, uh, maybe I got this right. I'm just going to start talking. And if you're listening, good. And if you ain't listening, well then you can't hear me. And what I'm going to say won't matter much to you. So, those of you that can't hear me, go frick yourself. Unless the broadcast is on repeat. And you happen to stumble across it later on. Then you can still go frick yourself. Okay, okay. Enough fricking yourself. It's time to get down to business. Brian is out trying to find some stuff to fix that old hollow tape he found. And while he's out, I figure it's about time to introduce myself. My name is Carl. Carl Cassidy. I'm probably the best damn good looking person left in this whole world. And if you're wondering about my voice, yes, this amazing voice that should only arouse your curiosity, well, I sound like this because I'm a freaking ghoul. I'm not one of those mindless, wandering, Trying to chase and eat your fool self, Barrel Ghouls. Nope. I'm the sophisticated Papa Ghoul. C L A S S Y. You see, about 26 years ago, when the bombs fell, those of us that couldn't afford to be in a vault had to just sit back and absorb the effects of that great mushroom cloud tanning salon. Our bodies soaked up all that radiation, and it turned us into what smooth-skinned wastelanders like to call ghouls. It's just unfortunate that some people soaked up a bit too much, and it fried their brains, making them those crazy assholes I was talking about earlier. Okay, so now you're starting to get any idea what I look like. Huh? Oh. Yeah, yeah you are, and you know you like it. Before the war, I was a foreman for a construction company in Boston. But I'm not from Boston originally. I'm actually from Owensboro, Kentucky, the home of bluegrass. I do miss a good Kentucky barbecue. Your choice of sumptuous meat, cooked all day so it's tender and delicious. And with all them fixings, sometimes I like to sit on the porch here at Omega, chomping on big juicy rad stag and imagine the good old days. The days of stuffing my face with a big smoked brisket washing it down with straight Kentucky bourbon, all while listening to the soundtrack of life. Blue moon of Kentucky. Crickets and bluegrass. 
When I first made my way down to West Virginia, I wasn't exactly sure I'd like it here. But after finding Omega and meeting Brian, I'm starting to like this place. The only thing I'm not liking is all these damn ugly ass frogs. Seriously, they are freaking everywhere. I don't know why, but Brian has some weird obsession with collecting a bunch of frogs in jars. It kind of freaks me out. It also doesn't help that I can't stand those little bastards. And no, I'm not going to tell you why I hate them. That's a personal and somewhat horrific story that I am never getting into. I swear, one day, I'm going to feed every last one of them to a death claw. But other than them slime devils, I'm loving it here. Brian let me know about his plans to try and rebuild and make this place better than before. And to tell you the truth, I like that a lot. When he got back with that old broken hollow tape, I saw something in him that I have not seen in anyone out here in a long time. I saw a man with hope. And even though I'm skeptical towards just about everything, I'm happy to make this place a home. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh. Now, now listen here, you little ass hopper. If you come anywhere near me, I, s I swear I'm the. God damn it. Sit. Sit, sit still, you dick. Well, uh, I think I need to go now. Look at this damn mess. Um, Carl? Hello? Come in. Um, Carl. Uh, what the hell's going on? Um, nothing. Why? What's up? How's the hunt for pots going? Just take your time getting back. Carl? Uh, Carl, wait. Carl, what the f- This is Brian Gwatney, the creator of the Omega Broadcast, A Fallout Story. I just wanted to take a moment real quick and just say thank you so much for checking out this podcast. I really hope you enjoy listening to these stories just as much as I enjoy making them. If you do enjoy this podcast, please let me know by liking, sharing, and even through your comments. Thank you again so much for your support. Remember, there's a place for you at the end. Omega. Omega.